Lucky BJ Beshies, welcome to my Christmas gifts unboxing. So these are gifts that I got for myself and from others. And if you want to know what I got for myself this Christmas, then please keep on watching. And I hope that Christmas has been really great for you. You were able to spend time with your family. I also hope you were able to hang out with your friends more. Overall, I just wish that Christmas has been very fruitful, meaningful, and amazing for you. Let's make this quick because I have a family gathering on my mother's side in like six hours. Let's start with the gifts that I got from others. So first one is this holiday indulgence set so this was given to me by my bff sitea and wow this smells really nice it's like candy cane with um florals so this is basically a bath set what this is because i still have a lot of toiletries that i have to use and i don't want to keep on opening new toiletries without finishing the previous ones because I just find it too wasteful and space-consuming. So this is a body lotion, um, an eye mask. We have a shower gel, body scrub, a body mist, lip balm, and I think this is a handheld mirror. Super nice. Thanks, Thea. Next would be the gifts from my mom. The gifts from my mother-in-law's side, they are in the fridge because it's food. So she got me a lot of coconut water and coconut milk because I am obsessed with coconut water nowadays. Plus, I got some random gifts from our neighbors. They're also food, so it's in the fridge already. Now, let's go to my mother's gift. She got me a book called Why We Sleep. I think this is a pang-asar lang of my mother because she knows that I rarely get 8 hours of sleep because I'm so busy with my business and my work. So it's like through this book, she's telling me, you gotta get enough sleep because she would always tell me that whenever, you know, we get the chance to chat uh, on Messenger, um, I will try to get enough sleep. Next, she got me this one also. It's her favorite makeup remover and it is mine too. It's Pond's Cold Cream. I can always use a makeup remover, so thank you, mom. And this is great if you are just wearing um light makeup, yung mga powder, ganon. Christmas gift naman sa akin ni hobby, it's money. The money that I got from him and also um, from my mother's side, I pulled everything to get this. So this year, I was thinking of getting a bag, but nothing really resonates with me. I just feel that I have enough bags that I can use. Plus, I got three bags this year, so maybe that's why it's not resonating with me. It's not clicking. So I just decided to upgrade my work gadgets. The last time I bought a laptop was in 2019, and my that's my MacBook Pro 2019. It's dead already. Well, almost dead. If you try typing on it, and if it's not plugged, siguro after like 10 minutes, it's gonna shut down because there's no battery anymore so i told myself i need to get a laptop i wanted something that i can bring outside if i need to do pitches or if i want to work outside or if i have to travel but at the same time i don't want it to be very expensive you will find out why later just something to replace my old laptop Plus, I want it to be not so new but at the same time not so old because if yung unit talaga is very old, it tends to get obsolete. It's like it cannot accommodate the new updates anymore. So yeah, so yung money that I got from them, I got this. Tadam! It's a MacBook Air 13 inch in space gray with the M1 chip. Plus 256 gig pa to. It's bigger than my usual. All my laptops are only around 128 gig. So this was on a sale from 69k. I got it for like 46 or 49 na lang. I used the money that I got to buy this. Yay! May bago na akong laptop. So ayun na siya. I'm surprised. It's kind of heavy rin pala. So that is my MacBook. Okay, yung next naman natin is from Joe Loves. So I just visited the store to take some videos, but since the guy was very attentive and he was really nice, I decided to buy from him because it's Christmas and I wanted to give him a sale. I just got a 50ml um, size because I really like small bottles so that I can bring them to, in my bag. So he, got, he gave me two samples of the signature scent of the brand, which is Joe Loves. Um, okay lang siya. It's very citrusy and it has that lychee note. So it's not for me. Not a big fan of lychee. Um, this perfume, when he sprayed it on me, I'm like, okay. 
It's so good because it's a soapy, citrusy floral. It smells like a fresh bouquet of summer florals. That's why I love it. That is number 42, The Flower Shop. I love it. It is a very nice summer daytime fragrance. Very casual. Magnetic cap to bish. Ayan. So Jo Malone is really good at making daytime fresh perfumes. So that's why whenever I would buy Jo Malone, and in this case, Jo loves, I always... I always look for a good daytime scent because that's really the strength of Jo Malone. Oh, by the way, I got this from Lazada. So this is a cheapy laptop case for my MacBook Air. I'm happy with cheap cases. Okay, na yan. Okay, so your next gift is from me. And I decided to treat myself to clothes. So I got a couple of pieces from Harlan and Holden. It's very expensive, but... When Harlan and Holden first came out, I just really like the brand and the clothes. And what I love about their clothes is even if you gain weight or lose weight, you can still wear the clothes because they are very functional and versatile. And their style is loose, so that's really my thing. And the clothes, they're also very classic and timeless, so you can just mix and match the pieces together. And the best part is, it's a Filipino brand, so let us support our own. So this is the top. It's a parachute top. I really love this. Because, ayan, kita nyo, parang meron siyang, ano, aircon sa likod. And yung shorts, it's already in the laundry. It's a corduroy-ish, loose, um, above-the-knee pair of shorts. I love it, ang ganda ng fit, color white siya. This is the other one. This is also the most expensive. This is a dress. It's more of like a utilitarian dress. I, I originally wanted this in the color lime, but I realized that this shade, this color, powder, is great even for summer or for yung mga cold months, like ngayon. As you can see, yung main feature dito is it's a garterized dress. So, garterized yung sa arms and also etong sa my waist and the nice thing about this is if you gain weight then you can just wear it like that you just have to like ribbon this thing in the middle and if you lose weight as you can see yung middle is garterized so all you have to do is just pull the ribbons to tighten up yung waist area so that it will fit you better and if you tighten it up ang nice siya because it creates this a-line shape really nice clothes engineered properly to look good on everyone no matter the size shape and weight i love harden and holden that's why i decided to invest in harden and holden pieces starting this year next are rubber shoes because the last time i bought rubber shoes was in 2019 it was my black nike metcon the rubberized toe cap it's already falling apart i almost tripped in one of my exercises and I got Metcon 9. Ayan, there's a black one. But, I don't know, this spoke to me. I'm kind of into pastels. Plus, it matches my top. This is really nice. It's really better for weightlifting. Because there is this parang rubber support in the middle. This is perfect for those who are into strength conditioning, CrossFit type workouts, and weightlifting like me. So, yan ang ganda niya. Super stable nitong part na to. Next. Next is from my mother. I really love her gift. This one, I have been contemplating on getting it for like two years now. But not this specific hair tool, the other one. But I just can't seem to pull the trigger for a lot of reasons. And besides, I was choosing between this and its more popular counterpart. But since owning the vacuum cleaner of this brand, I'm happy with it. So I decided, hey, why not, you know, get the hair tool that you really that I really want. The other hair tool is just more popular, but after a lot of research, I felt and I realized I will get more use out of this and I'm so happy that my mother decided to give this to me for Christmas. Ta-da! Dyson Supersonic! Oh my god! So happy. I love blow dryers because it's part of my routine, my daily hair care routine. Okay, as you all know, the more popular counterpart is the air wrap. That thing is just highly publicized and featured on social media but i realized i am a lazy girl my hair i just wash dry and wear it down that is my hair it can barely hold any curls plus i really don't have the patience to curl even if i like it, i like it if my hair is curled but yeah after researching i figured that i'll get more use out of this and she got me by you ano yung prussian blue and bronze combo i love this and i think this is the new version already because it has newer attachments ah! Oh, I'm so excited to use 
this. I will tinker with this after shooting this video. Thank you, Mama. Thank you so much. I have my last two gifts here. So I'm just gonna push this camera. I mentioned earlier that I will tell you why I bought a not so new but not so old laptop for work. It's because I bought another computer. This one is very brand new. It's the latest release for its um, variant. And since aging na ang eyes ng inyong Tito Marta, I am having a hard time reading letters and things on a laptop. Plus, yung neck ko, since yung laptop na is small and you tend to like bow if you're working, I'm feeling it on my neck, besh. As in, masakit na siya. So, I decided to buy a desktop. Actually, the deciding factor for me is when this um, computer came out in different colors. It was available on the Apple.com website, the Philippines version. So, when it launched in the website and when it was finally available for ordering, I ordered it already. I was kind of bummed because the delivery estimate um, was between December 22 to March 24. What the heck? It's a Christmas gift. Baka dumating ng March. But anyway, wala lang. So I just let it go. And then I told myself, it is what it is. If it comes around March, gan talaga. But just after 10 days from ordering, it arrived. I'm so happy. Just in time for the holidays. Like, three days before Christmas. I got myself... Tada! I got myself a pink iMac 24-inch and... M3! This is the M3 chip na! Oh my god! Hindi ko na bubuksan na because it's a riot when I open this one but that's it. Yun lang siya. Next natin is for our final unboxing. And it's this, my Prada! Okay, my camera is blinking now. Oh my god, I really have to change my camera. Ang bilis na maubos ng battery. Okay, this thing, I have been visiting it in the Prada store since last year. Because, you know, I just can't decide. And at the same time, it really takes a while for me to decide. But since I really, really liked it, I decided last Friday. And that's if I see this particular pair of shoes. And it's in the color I like and in my size it's a sign I have to get it. And they have my size and it's in the color I like and last stock siya best. So this is it. Sorry I'm kinda rushing na because my battery is blinking in battery sign. It's gonna run out. So ito siya. Oh my gosh. I really need a pair of casual shoes because I just have loafers and rubber shoes. And yung aking Hermes Oasis that I really don't want to abuse. I love it so much. And my final Christmas gift. And finally, I have this. I'm so happy. Can't wear to wear it. ta -da! The Prada Monolith Sandals. Oh my gosh. Ang ganda. I'm gonna wear this tomorrow. And I love it because it looks great. Whether you're wearing shorts, skirts, dresses, or jeans. Most especially jeans. Plus, oh my gosh, it's very lightweight. I'm surprised that um, it's really light. I thought it's heavy because, you know, it's so chunky. I really hate my camera. I just ran out of battery again. I think I need to buy a new camera now. Super luma na rin itong G7X Mark II ko. But anyway, so yeah, so these are my monolith sandals. As I was saying, I don't have to worry if I have to take this out on the rain or if I have to walk uneven and rough pavements, which is, you know, a characteristic of the, the roads and the streets here in the Philippines because it's rubber so if it gets dirty all I have to do is just brush it with soap and water and it's gonna look spanking new and yeah thanks for watching this video and I hope you like this video again Merry Christmas and don't forget to follow my social media accounts visit my blog subscribe to my Instagram and to my TikTok and I'll see you in the next video so yeah if there's anything here that you want me to make a review of especially for the Dyson blow dryer the iMac and also, these shoes, let me know in the comments and I'll see you around. Bye, Veshies. Merry Christmas again and Happy New Year.